inside Saks and it's so bright and fun. Look at all of these colors. So I'm gonna take you into Chanel first and then I'm gonna come back over here to Valentino and show you everything else. Look at this little small Chanel here, this teal color. They've got new pink, they've got the Chanel 19 here. And then this is their new rose gold collection. They've got some medium size wallet. Wallet machine. And they've got this cute little top in the box. This beautiful camel color. Look at this trendy in the white, stark white lamb skin. They've got this boy style bag, this red one. Check out this. These little cute ones. And then look at this gorgeous tweed one. It's so larger trendy. This one I've never seen before. Then check out this one over here. This little knee square. This bag is so unique. I've got these little tennis bag ones. Look at this necklace. I've got these belts. They have so many classic ones right now on display. This denim one. They've got these. The Chanel 19 bag. Oh, and they have this light denim one. Patent. This one I've seen before. It's so beautiful with the crystal details. And then there's this one. And then they've got these boy bags. This one here is in caviar. And then this one's lambskin. They've got this beautiful Chanel 18 bag. And then this over here is a seasonal piece. Okay, we're back at the Valentino, this area now. And they've got these rock stud bags. Here is a so black one. Check out these Valentino belts. They're so sparkly. Not a fan of the huge logo, but here are their rock stud, Roman rock stud bags. And then we're at Laura Piana right now. And look at this amazing coat and this gorgeous scarf. So super soft, really beautiful, this piece. And then what else do they have? They've got these super classic bags, not a fan of that. But I wanna take you inside Fendi real quick. I see that they have some of their um, Tiffany collaboration, which is cool because I went to another Fendi and they were like, oh, they're sold out everywhere. But you never trust people because, <laughs> never take someone's word for something if it's sold out, if you actually want the item because you will find it if you really want it. Um, but yeah, this is 0.925 sterling silver. Um, really cool piece, this is all beaded and that is from their Tiffany collaboration. This is their classic baguette bag. Look at this sweater. It's pretty neat. We've got this one over here. And then look at this beautiful peekaboo bag. This brown color is so nice. I feel like the lighting isn't so great, but there you can see it a little bit better. Got these little mini pouches little baby peekaboo bags, they're twillies. And then these are classics that I've pretty much already shown you. And then I gotta show you this incredible croc piece. This is a peekaboo and then look at the handle on that, amazing. And then check out this little peekaboo over here with the mink, very statement. There's these guys over here. And then there's this croc Fendi first bag in like a super deep brown, it's really beautiful. And then there's some mink ones up there. I think that's gonna wrap it up for Fendi. Look at these new spring colors for Gucci. So this is the Blondie bag, this and the Jackie. They're my two favorite Gucci bags. They're just so classic, timeless, vintage looking. They have it in the classic monogram, but I love these new colors, especially that green one in back. I'm gonna go head in and see if I can film that for you guys. So here's the green one and look at that. It's got a little top handle. That is pretty cool. Some stud detailing, gorgeous. Love this size though, this is my favorite size. And over here, I just wanna quickly show you a couple of the Jackie bags. I like it when they're in more firm leather. This is like a softer pebbled leather. Um, but yeah, for example, this one over here, this is in a smooth calf skin. And I just think the Jackie looks so nice in this type of leather. Really beautiful. This is a special one with ostrich and snake skin. Pretty cool colorway, and I love these Gucci shoes. These are so pretty. Those ones are great. And then this over here, another snakeskin one in blue. Sorry, I'm talking so soft. I just always am like discreet when I'm filming. Um, but yeah, these are so pretty as well. 
and we've got this one over here in lizard I believe gorgeous color hey guys I am interrupting this video for two reasons first of all I got my YouTube plaque so thank you guys so so much this I've been wanting this for so long I appreciate this so much so it's really cool I wanted to share it with you guys and also this video is kindly sponsored by ritual I've worked with ritual a few times and I love them so basically I take their daily vitamins they make different vitamins and I've also been taking their symbiotic plus which is a three-in-one prebiotic probiotic and postbiotic I'm gonna quickly uh, let you know what each one of those things is it basically helps your gut health so prebiotics support the growth and activity of beneficial bacteria living in the gut probiotics are live microorganisms they help to include things like bloating and then postbiotics provides fuel to the cells that make up the gut lining and support gut barrier function and then the other great thing about these little capsules is that they're delayed release so they help get to your colon and not your stomach which is is the ideal place for bacteria to grow also no refrigeration is ever required and also transparency is at the core of everything that ritual does so they actually let you know exactly where they source their nutrients even where they source their environmental things for like shipping the products also shipping is always free and I do have a code it's just double vanilla that's gonna get you 20% off your first month so make sure you hit that link in my description box it's gonna be the very first link just click that or you can go to ritual.com and again you can use my code it's double vanilla that's gonna get you 20% off for your first month and um, yeah that's it so I'm going to share with you now the next clip I hope you enjoy the rest of this video we're inside Louis Vuitton and this is from their new collection the Petite Mal I've already done a full Louis Vuitton shopping vlog um, of their flagship location on 5th Avenue so I share the full collection there so make sure you check that out because it's an epic vlog I don't know if it's posted yet but I hope so um, and if it's not then it's definitely coming but I will link it below if I don't post it. So here is some of the Louis Vuitton fine jewelry. These bracelets are so pretty. They're beautiful. In the Louis Vuitton flagship vlog, I did not show any of the fine jewelry. So this I'm glad to be able to show you here. The ring is so pretty. I love this blue one. And then look at these little dainty ones. This is rose gold, Louis Vuitton's rose gold. They've got the Pavé diamonds. These earrings are amazing. And then look at these necklaces. Oh, I just love those. Yeah, these ones are really, really beautiful over here. And then let me just show you some of the luggage. These are very cool. Imagine traveling with this thing. I never really think luggage is a great investment piece, but really cool. This is a key ball in red. And look at these little chunks. I guess they're kind of like jewelry boxes. You can put anything in them. Okay, I just want to show you this cup of scenes over here and this gorgeous silver crock. It's beautiful. They've got the red one over here and then they've got this little baby one with the blooms. So beautiful. And then they've got the classic black one so this is their new belt it's really cool i'm not sure the name of it but i love the hardware detail on it and this is the new collection and this is such a statement piece really really cool and then over here these are some of their classics this one over here and then i did all the sunglasses some of their sunglasses this one over here i love the tortoise shell I want to show you some of these Kate bags. So this one is so unique over here. $12.50. And this one I love. This again, this is all Kate. I've got this crystal one. And then there's these ones over here. They make such great totes. This one here is super vintage looking, red patent leather. And then look at this Kate bag. Again, another super unique piece. And then here are a few handbags from the row. This little bucket bag with the tie knot. This one over here. I really like the lock detail. I'm not a fan of the color, but it comes in so many different colors. And I always love the row. They're like oversized hobo bags. This is in a pretty suede, almost like a burgundy color. Okay, I wanted to quickly show you some Dior. Look at this amazing dress. And the belt. This is from the saddle collection. So cool. And... This great sweater, 
love these. They come in a shorter version as well. Here are some very spring inspired colors for their wallets and small other goods. This little piece, you can make it into a bag. It's got a little top handle chain. This is a little wallet on chain over here. This little toiletry pouch and some more compact wallets and longer ones. And here's that bag, I guess you can call that in a bigger size, the little pouches. I want to show you guys the new earring collection. I love these little dangly ones, they're so pretty. And then these ones over here. Love the necklaces, the pearl one. This one over here is pretty cool. And then they've got some rings over there brooches. This over here is to put on your bag. So let's say you had a Birkin, you'd connect it to each of the little hardware pieces. Yeah. Hermes made one just like this, but they discontinued it. But it looks really pretty on those bags. And then over here, they've got some tribal earrings. I love these with a the little star detail. Hopefully it's focusing. And then these ones over here, let's see if it can focus. Hopefully. These ones are so pretty with the Christian Dior CD and the star detail. And then they have it without the crystals. Sometimes it's really hard to focus um, on these little mini earrings. They've got these great twillies. There's sunglasses. I like these ones over here. And then over here they've got their Caro bags. Lots of pretty like neutral colors. Let me just turn this around and show you guys compare the different sizes. Thank you. So pretty. Uh, and then there's this one with the terracotta color. Really beautiful. And then they also have it in white. And I love the back pocket detailing on this bag. This is such like a functional bag. Super easy to use. I love these colors over here. In that same terracotta color, they've got the medium Lady Dior bag. It's a really unique color. Really pretty. And then just pop that back. They've got the little mini one. So pretty. Um, and then they also have it in the larger size. Let me show you. This one they added on a little strap. The big one actually looks kind of cool. I bet that would look really nice styled. And then they've got the canvas one, some of their gorgeous straps. And then up there is the Lady D Joy. And then I'm gonna end Dior by just quickly showing you some of their belts. This is their classic CD one. I like it in the smaller size. I think it looks really pretty. Um, they've got the ones with the crystals. This one. There it is up there. And then this over here. I think this is from their defense line. This is like an older version. Um, or maybe the saddle style. But yeah, these are so pretty. Oh yeah, this is the small one that I like, but in black. It's cool. So these are those Loewe sunglasses, super unique. Pretty cool. I do want to show you a little bit of ready to wear at Saks. So this is by Burberry. What a cool piece. I mean, look at all this hardware hanging off of it. And even the shirt underneath has got the ruffle detailing. This is actually all Burberry. And I love the asymmetry of this piece. You see how it cuts off and then it's longer. So, so neat. And then one last Burberry piece that I'd love to show you guys is this leather piece over here. Look at that belt detailing. I am seeing so much more silver hardware, which is really cool. Look how amazing this is. So this is all Alexander McQueen over here. Such a cool leather jacket and the skirt. And then look at this piece. So this is from the row. I love this little detailing when it has like a built-in scarf. That looks so good. And then we've got this piece from Chloe. It's got the classic Chloe scalloping that she does all the time. And then let me see what else do they have. This is Bottega over here. A little bit difficult to show. There's these great mannequins over here and it's all by this brand called Sergio Hudson. So cool. There's some Stella McCartney back there. Let me show you some of it. This really pretty dress. So many crystals and sequins still in a lot of the ready-to-wear. Even this denim jacket over here. Let's see. 
This is Stella McCartney. And then over here is a lot of Fendi ready to wear all of these really pretty pinks. So much fun, this coat. There's this sweater over here. It's like a little bomber jacket. Love this piece. This is gorgeous. And I love the little detail over there, the little Fendi detail. Let's see the price. So $26.50 for this dress. Really pretty. And then over here, this great jacket. This is a shorter version of that coat little bit cropped and then this coat over here is amazing again I love the color and I really love the little slit detail again this kind of has well not real I was gonna say a built-in scarf it looks like it's a built-in scarf that is beautiful wow what a statement this piece is this is definitely my favorite thing I've seen so far for the ready to wear there's some Versace over here super low cut um, these pants over here they've got little Versace um, hardware this little belt detail and then I want to show you Chloe so many beautiful like very feminine pieces again the same color tone like lots of pinks and creams and linens this is like a really pretty linen shirt these little shorts over here very like uh, 60s 50s inspired same with this tunic style dress and then check out this with the ruffles it's got the uh, smocking on the back and then very girly and really pretty and then check out this sergio hudson suit very 70s inspired with the velvet and this kind of like boucle material I love the pocket detail it's pretty cool I love this two-piece over here so this is Alexander McQueen so cool this little blazer detail and the cutouts same with the skirt i wish the skirt was shorter because i just feel like it's more flattering a shorter skirt i don't know i think it's a weird length but such a cool two-piece and then here's some oscar de la renta they make crazy incredible pieces like these gowns are insane super statement look at this little piece over here very preppy and then I gotta show you this silver piece with all of the fringe detail. This is really cool. Look at that. Crazy. I love fringe. And wow, imagine how this looks on. Such a great piece. So this retails for 10,990 US dollars. Crazy. Um, but what an amazing dress. I'm sure you can find a dupe of this online such a crazy crazy piece so this is by Acris and look at that little back piece so imagine pairing this together with this fringe and then you have it poking out that would look so neat I think um, Acris makes some really cool pieces like even this longer leather jacket I really like I think it's really nice got these wide leg pants and then this kind of mosaic top all right check out these outfits this is my awake mode i love this so much so cool i mean what a great outfit this entire three-piece set and then this is again awake mode they're really known for you see how there's like the little circle cutouts they're really known for that they've got their most famous skirt is basically it goes all the way down the way this top is so this comes in like a dress version. Really, really cool with the cutouts. And then this over here is by David Coma. Such a gorgeous dress, really, really beautiful. And then this over here is Alexander McQueen. Love the asymmetry and I adore the cutouts in the back. That is so pretty. Here is a little bit of Moinat. I love this trunk. They've got great little card cases. This little black chapeau bag is really cool. Louis Vuitton does a really similar one. And then again, one of their little mini trunks. And over here, this is more of their classic pieces. This little baby one. They've got the next size up. And then this here is like a little pochette, really similar to the Hermes Kelly uh, pochette. And then they also have it in a little bit of a larger size than the shirt.
Yeah. 